Hey, what's up, Madden people? Crazy Hot Boy E here at the ES Fred. We're coming to you with another video. And today I got a video about Madden, NFT, and blockchain games. Now, I've been waiting on this. Um, I've literally put on my Patreon. I show them how I started making money um, with cryptocurrency and the blockchain. I put out a couple of videos on Patreon. I haven't released it on YouTube yet. Um, so this is going to be the first actual video and guys when i tell you that ea madden crypto are gonna go hand in hand it is definitely gonna go hand in hand now nft is something different that's a non-fungible token um which i can explain to you guys too later in this, in this video um but i want to talk about the blockchain and how i'm already investing in games where you can play them and earn money i literally just got done making money today off the blockchain off a game called Monster Slayer. Um, if you want to look it up, it's on the crypto code MS. What it is, um, you get your Monster Slayer and you go battle other monsters and you fight each other, um, but you earn crypto while playing the game. Now, how can this work for Madden? Super, super, super easy, guys. Madden already has a coin. And as we all know, coin is king. That's all my channel is about, is making coins in Madden. Um, so once Madden decides to release this coin on the blockchain, you no longer have to worry about your, your coins dying off for the year. Um, you, no, you no longer have to worry about selling your coins and getting banned. It will all be possible to own coins and then turn that coin into cash. Now, let's go ahead and look at this article right here. This is a super short article. It says, the gaming giant EA Sports acknowledges the potential of NFTs and gaming to its investors. Now, EA obviously is gonna care about its investors, the people that it has to make money for, um, the elite class of the world, they care about money, um, but making money for its players is definitely gonna be a possibility because literally every game in the blockchain, if you're gonna be playing that game, it's gonna be, the, the best games are gonna be ones where you earn crypto while playing the game. And you all know you can turn crypto into actual cash. So let's go ahead and read the article here. It says, the gaming publisher who created the likes of FIFA and Madden recently had its CEO talking about the potential of blockchain-based gaming. While this has been interpreted as the publisher's entry into the world of NFT games. Now, the world of NFT games is really, really simple, guys. Um, so if you don't know what an NFT is, an NFT is basically a digital piece of art. Now, it can evolve into music. It can evolve into so much more stuff but what it is right now it's called a non-fungible token and it's a piece of art and you put this art on the blockchain you have things like open c um you have things like so c where everybody just all these investors they go in and look at all this art and they buy their favorite pieces of art and literally what happens is it sells for money and it rises it goes down it's just like a regular auction house um but you can snipe these art pieces you can sell these, you can buy them and hold them, you can sell them for high. Anything that you can do in Madden is clearly gonna correlate with NFTs as well too. And so, I think this is why they're saying that we acknowledge that we have to figure this out because literally making coins in Madden and making coins in the blockchain is damn near the same thing. If you, if you subscribe to my Patreon, I'm literally gonna start showing guys how I'm making coins um, in cryptocurrency, I literally got it from starting in Madden. I got my Coinbase in Madden, sold my coins, got my money, put my money into crypto, and now I'm up about 2000 I could be up about $5,000, but I totally messed up today. But I'm up about $2,000 right now, and that portfolio is going to be growing more and more every other, every single day with all these new releases coming out. But let's go ahead and keep moving down. So the gaming industry has already seen the light. Of crossover between NFT and games the past few months, like Axie Affinity, Sandbox. If you go look at Axie Affinity token, you go look at Sandbox token. These are games that are on slow blockchain, guys. Literally, the blockchain is so slow, and the game is not it's not nowhere near as advanced as Madden, but it's absolutely doing amazing, guys. These games are absolutely doing amazing. They're making lots of money. It's going for like two, three dollars. People literally buying in for like five cents. And watching the game go to like two freaking dollars, guys. Nothing but profit, profit to be made there. So while it is hard to predict how the sports will adopt to NFT gaming, the acknowledgement of the such parallel space regards to own 
is certainly good news. Ubisoft 2 has announced their own entree into the world of NFT gaming. Now, there's a little game called Project Seed, um, where Call of Duty Marvel games have already jumped into the space. Once Madden jumps into the space, guys, it's over. I'm already learning about crypto every day. Crypto is something I'm passionate about. Crypto is something I put my focus into. I want to financially secure myself. I want to be a millionaire. And I believe I can be a millionaire at 33 years old, which is going to be this year, this birthday, if I stick to learning crypto and growing in crypto. And not only can I do this, you guys can do this as well, too. So you can purchase as many NFT packs as you want, purchase as many Madden packs as you want, um, buy the best team all the time, and just grind out Madden and still be able to take care of your family as well, too. So, yeah, if we look at this, the game publisher currently already has a collectible content. Um, Ultimate Team Mode. Obviously, we got Ultimate Team Mode, which is just like NFTs. You basically collect a card art, and the card art you collect, you can play with in-game. So, and you're earning coins. The only thing is, those coins that you're earning in the game, they have to figure out how to turn it into a real-life coin on the blockchain so you can take that coin and actually make money off of it, guys. Guys, be excited. We're going to be making money off of playing and add Madden in the future. Now, we're probably like two or three years away from making money off playing Madden, but trust me, guys, every other game on the blockchain is talking about, is moving towards, you play this game, you're going to make money playing this game, and it's going to be the same with this as well, too. So, yeah, that is the video today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions about NFTs, subscribe to the Patreon. I'll be dropping a lot of content over there about how I'm making money in crypto and NFTs and also the blockchain. And then I'll also, this is the start of it, guys. My channel is moving towards Madden and crypto. If you follow me on Twitter, it says Madden, it says crypto over there. So I'm already starting to get into this. I've been doing this for like the last month or so, maybe three weeks or so. And I'm only going to get into this more heavily. So when you start this, you do got to start at ground zero because it is a new technology. But the faster you jump into it, the faster you're going to be able to make money, the faster you're going to be able to understand what's going on in the crypto world. All right. Have a good day. Better tomorrow, guys. We'll talk to you later. Peace out, my Gs.